Alright, today I'll show you how to use IR Shell for the PSP. Now, this is a. I'm going to use the remote function on this, and this. I like this program a lot. I actually like it better than the Universal Remote program that I showed you in the earlier videos. Um. Because it, it works with a lot more stuff. So, I'll show you. Um, here. You go to Game and then Memory Stick. If that'll focus. Yeah, there it is. Memory Stick. And it's not that IR shell, but you gotta go to this one right there. Go down to. Just open that up here. I'll turn on the sound a little bit. Alright. Wait for that to load. And that should come up with a screen like that. Alright, then you uh, arrow right over to that one right there. That's the remote. You can see it says IR Remote View. Click it. X. And then you find, I'll show you how to get all these codes in the video, but um, you find the TV that you have, or whatever appliance you have, and I have a Toshiba, click X, and I just had to fiddle around with all these different codes to see which one worked, and I found out this one right here, the top one works for mine actually, so I click X, and then it gives you all the different functions like power, channel up, mute, all that stuff that you would find on your remote. And so this one says O for power, so if you watch the TV there in front of you, hopefully it'll work. Here we go. Oh. And there it goes. Turns on. Say you want to chain to channel 32, so just press up and then triangle, and it goes to channel 32. And that's the Food Network. <laughs> little ESPN. Do left and then triangle. So that's how you do it. Use remote function on uh or use the IR shell. I think it's pretty uh cool. Hope you like the video. Comment if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.